time it is. Yep. This weekend we're celebrating Earth Day at the Metro Parks. Yep, the holiday turns 53 this year and you're all invited to the party. So in today's Metro Parks <laughs> Monday, we are heading to the Cherry Tree Grove at Brookside's Reservation to hang out with Mary Rouse. Mary, good morning to you. I saw the big sign uh, off I-71 there at the Brookside. Uh, boy, it looks nice. It does, doesn't it? We call it the Hollywood sign. More to yeah. come on Oh, that. it does. I yeah. saw it last you know night. Yeah, yeah, it looks great. So let's talk about the cherry blossoms. Excellent. Well, well, the cherry blossoms were right here. I would say, you know, maybe there was a little bit of peak, maybe on Friday. It was packed yeah. here. Obviously, we had beautiful weather last week, but it is still lovely. Um, so you got a couple more days to come on out here. The wind's making it feel a little bit like it might be <laughs> snow. I don't want to say that Ooh. at all, yeah. um, but, but they are lovely. You know, it's just one of the many th spring things we've got going on, as you may know. Brookside Reservation connects right in with the zoo, and yeah. that is where we're gonna kick off some of our Earth Day celebrations next week. So next Saturday here at the zoo, Party for the Planet, and the Party for the Planet 5K race. So you do the race, and you get into the zoo for free, where we've got all kinds of extra Earth Day sorts of activities. Also talk about what's going on uh, at Edgewater Beach already with this great yeah. art and craft fair. Exactly. Well, we've got all sorts of things next weekend. Up at Edgewater on Sunday, we have the Driftwood giveaway. So Driftwood, everybody knows what that like. Well, we clean up our beaches. Our team up there is wonderful cleaning it up. So we have lots and lots of the Driftwood. Artists can come by, artist collectors on Sunday from 10 to 2. You got to load it and pack it, but you can get your own Driftwood. So that is Sunday. In addition, on Sunday, we've got a rain barrel workshop. Make your own rain barrel at the Canalway Center. You do need to register for it, but this cool thing, you connect it to the, the gutter coming off of your roof, and then you can use it to water your plants. You can hook up a hose, you can wash your car, you can do whatever you like with it. And you get those great nutrients that are, that are coming down as well mm -hmm. from, the, from that recycled water. It just, it's a, such a benefit to, to the gardening. Hey, let's talk about some of the hikes you guys have planned as, as well, Mary. I know this is a great time to get out uh, even though the weather may not be as pleasant as we like, but boy, so everything's blooming now, and that's the nice thing to see mm -hmm. when you go on these hikes. Everything. It's we've got spring wildflower hikes and dogwood hikes, all things all weekend long. I think the highlight of the weekend for us here on the park side, though, is at the Brexville Nature Center on Saturday. We're going to have an upcycling Earth Day. So we're going to have your, the opportunity to make all sorts of upcycled crafts. One of which using my very favorite, which is Plarn. It's yarn made out of plastic bags. Um, we also will have vendors there who are going to be selling their upcycled products as well. So you can come out, you can hike, you can go to the uh, to the zoo, to the Brexville Earth Day Festival. We have it all this weekend. Boy, that's awesome. What a great time to be out in the Metro Parks and so many things that are there as well. And uh, boy, when you talk about those cherry blossoms, I know, yeah, my my, uh, my magnolia tree at home, all the petals blew off as well. So uh, unfortunately, but, but boy, just to go out there and yeah. be among those and know that they're there every year is such a, such a great thing. Mm -hmm. It really is. It really is. And like I said, spring wildflowers are in full bloom. And I have an insider tip for you. Oh, Would you okay, like an tell insider us. tip related yes. to wildflowers? Yes, tell us. Just yesterday, what, when it was still 70 degrees, I went to Bedford Reservation and the bluebells are just about to pop. Oh, good. So nice. go to Hemlock. Hemlock Creek picnic area yeah. and check out those bluebells next weekend. They will be amazing. Oh, oh, that's great. See, that's what you get. You get pro insider tips right mm -hmm. here with Mary. <laughs> exactly. All exactly. Right, Mary. Thanks, Mary. Mary thanks. Appreciate it. Enjoy your day and we'll see you guys yeah. next week. All right. Thank you. Right. Bye bye. Thank you. That's awesome. All right. So we've got all the information on uh, what you need to do. And if some of the things that you need to register for, just go to fox8.com. Yeah. We'll link you here. Again, here's all the info on the Earth Day events. So The 5K, um, yeah. Yeah. Again, so register now through Wednesday. And you'll save a lot of money, too.